It's been a journey of 60 years for the legal luminary, a rare Feba Balola in the profession, and this hall is filled with big names in Nigeria and beyond who have come to grace the anniversary. The event also produces unending accolades as former president or passenger describes the senior lawyer as highly principled, committed and accomplished. I have come to know and learn a lot from Mare Afebabalala. He's a man you must never take for granted. If you do, you are on your own. That I will say to you. He's a serious-minded man. And if you don't know that, you don't know anything. If he's laughing with you, and it's humorous, a little bit. But when you hit him on the wrong side, you will see the other side of his eyes. And more tributes pouring from the Ekiti State Governor, Mr. Biodun Oyebanji, and a representative from King's College, London, Professor Fumi Oloni Shaki. On behalf of everyone at the University of London, it gives me great pleasure to congratulate Are Afe Babalola on the 60th anniversary of being called to bar. Are, your journey is remarkable and an inspirational example of everything we strive to do as a university. Daddy, I congratulate you. Thank you so much for what you are to humanity. Thank you so much for providing platform for those that are hopeless to have hope. Thank you, Daddy, because I can stand here today as a governor of Ekiti State because of people like you. But it's not only a day for praises, as the keynote speaker also addresses the issue of constitutional reforms in Nigeria Coming to participate in the making of the constitution is always at the discretion of the person who is the president. And he uses other sources of information. But I found that the struggle to represent traditional rulers, to represent the church, to represent all kinds of aggregate groups, ends up with a lot of people with very little understanding of what constitution making is. And what, I, what became very clear to me that most of the people who showed up saw the place as a theater for political and political transaction. The biggest applause of today in celebration. The diamond celebrant, Are Afe Babalola, mounts the podium, highlighting his call for a new and truly federal constitution if Nigeria will be rightly run. Nigeria is not one country. It's a country of more than 300 nations and tribes. You need a new constitution which will allow each part to develop at its own rate and at the same time a nation will now evolve from that constitution. Are Babalola has trained over a thousand lawyers and has produced at least 25 senior advocates of Nigeria reputed as the largest by any law firm in the country. No wonder there's the launch of a book in its honor titled Unveiling the Diamond at the Bar. Another highlight of the event is a panel discussion which is chaired by former president of Basenjo. Democracy, it is a journey, it's not a destination. I'm saying that the ugly past is not behind us at all. Because today, the level of corruption in Nigeria has assumed a very dangerous dimension. Highly placed public officers, Steal money men for building hospitals and people are dying on our roads. And for the new government, the president must show leadership. Are Afe Babalola has been conferred with over 50 titles and awards across the globe, including Honorary Doctor of Laws and Doctor of Letters from 10 universities, including the University of London, University of Lagos, 
and University of Ibado. 58. The event ended with the cutting 59. of the diamond anniversary cake. 60. For he's a jolly good fellow.